yeah Man, these niggas ain't worthy The day I make a million It's the day they scream mercy Mercy Got my truck so dirty The day I make a million It's the day they scream mercy Yo, it's your boy Bizmatic You know, I appreciate everyone for waiting on me This whole Determined 2 project this whole BNM project we also got coming out, but I just want to let y'all know a little bit why you had to wait and why it took a whole year off. First of all, I feel like it wasn't the right time to put anything out. And another thing is I was going through my own little personal issue, but that's no excuse though. The main reason was I feel like music is in a state where a lot of niggas ain't being themselves and a lot of people, they're not really focusing on the actual music. And if I was going to put something out, I want it to be something real, something I really believe in, something I feel like is a fucking classic right off the back. And with Determined 2, I accomplished that. So shout out to Merc, shout out to Ghetto J, shout out to um, Leo Beats for being a part of this project. And I feel like this is the right time to put it out. And a lot of the shit that I've been hearing too, I'm not really like really into. I feel like a lot of niggas, they don't take the time to really like put together something real, something that they can really feel. I feel like I'm hearing a lot of the same things over. Like, I'm not seeing no personality. I remember I had this conversation with C's. He was like, yo, what's, what's Providence's sound? Like, what's the sound coming out of Rhode Island? You know what I'm saying? A hey, niggas just jumping on whatever's hot. And I'm not really into that. So I feel like if I was going to put out a project, it's going to be some shit that niggas could really feel niggas could be like oh shit i could relate to that because i'm from out here so that was another thing too so i wanted to put it out at the right time for the people i'm not charging it's it's all free even if it's just one nigga waiting on it i just appreciate it so much that i feel like i gotta give it my personal best so that's another reason why i took a little time with it and another thing too a lot of niggas they dropping like 30, 40 mixtapes a year. I don't see the point of it when in reality you can just drop something that's like really good and, and like live off that, something that you truly believe in. Because think about it. If you're throwing all this work out, we know you ain't really taking your time with it. You know what I'm saying? So with me, it's all about the people. So that's why it took so long. And plus, if I had dropped this project earlier, I feel like I would take away from it. It wouldn't be right. It would just be one of those things that you just throw out there like, all right, cool, here, there you go, have it. I went to make it right. I went to film all the videos. So shout out to Tony Biz behind the camera right there. Um, I went to shoot all the videos. I went to shoot promo shit like this shit right here. And I really want motherfuckers to feel it. Like, it's it's real. It's not, I'm not, I'm not just waking up and I'm like, here's a track on SoundCloud, here's a track on fucking Facebook, like, it's real, like, we really working to give you the best, the best quality, whoever's paying attention to it, but, yeah, so, that's why it took so long, but, thank you for waiting for it, it's a fucking classic, I'm happy about it, D2, BNM, shout out to everyone, everyone, even if it's two of you, if it's one of you, if it's just me, shout outs, I'm fucking happy with it, and it's gonna be a classic, and y'all gonna love it. Yeah. Uh, yeah, man, these niggas ain't worthy the day I make a million, it's the day they scream mercy, mercy. Got my chucks so dirty the day I make a million, it's the day they scream mercy, mercy.